Welcome. What I want to do today is show you how to simplify this expression of 6y divided by 15y minus x minus y divided by 15y. So usually our case when simplifying is you know, to do whatever you can to simplify. You see I have a fraction here, 16y divided by 15y, and it's probably your intuitive thing to think, oh, well, let's reduce that fraction, right? Well, that's a good idea, but notice I have an operation of subtraction, right? And I have two rational terms. Well, remember, when you have fractions or rational terms, um, remember to combine them or use any operations, they have to have the same denominator. As this problem is written, I have the same denominator. So I'm going to want to keep that, and then I'll do maybe some simplifying or reducing at the end. So it's very good that right now I have them as the same denominator, meaning I don't need to do anything. I know that whenever I have two fractions with the same denominator, I just subtract the numerators and keep the denominator the same. Right? Two-thirds minus one-third equals two minus one over three, which equals one-third. All right? So that's just your little side example. So that's exactly what I'm going to do here. I'm going to do 6y minus, in parentheses, x minus y. All right? Because be careful. Remember, you're not subtracting x. You're subtracting x minus y. And that's all over 15y. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to distribute this negative sign. So I'll have 6y minus x plus y over 15y. Now what I can do is I can just combine the 6y plus the y. Since I can't combine a y and an x, since they're not the same factor, they're not like terms, I can only combine the 6y and the y. Since they're both positive, I'm going to add them up. So my final answer will be 7x, or 7y, right? 7y minus x divided by 15y. And there you go. That's your final answer. Thanks.